chill my crew. Now the blisters do, do their job. Now the blister doing their job. This is what they were designed for all along, and now they decide that they actually want to try to do it. What is going on again, Nerd Paraders? Thank you guys so much for coming back to hang out with me today. We're back on the high seas with one man and a ship, also known as Uno Moss, my favorite working title. And we've done some changes to the Numero Uno, our fancy vessel, our first vessel of testing. And if you're unfamiliar with what Uno Moss is, it's one man sailing a galleon, my, which happens to be my favorite boat in all of Atlas, and trying to solo his way through the world as the best pirate captain he can live up to be. So if you caught the previous episode, we were really trying to go something super crazy with the only Ballista Galleon. It turns out that it requires more testing. It turns out that only Ballistas don't really work out as well as I thought they would. So we've done something a little bit different. If you remember the ceiling that we had here with the extra Ballistas, I actually ended up scrapping that and taking it down. And we've only got one row on each side of Ballista. The most important part about this and what the big takeaway is, is 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 station ordering. So we've got station ordering for the ballista. They have the settings set to only shoot at enemy survivors and crew members. So my goal is to try to use the ballista to take out whales that are not only surrounding me for survival, but to take out enemy crew and maybe even the enemy captain if we sail by their ship. An uncaptained ship should be an easy sink, is what I'm going by with my logic here. So I've ordered everybody. I've got all my ordering set up. It's been probably the biggest pain in the ass of the whole thing is going gun by gun or ballista by ballista setting up station ordering. But that is now done, out of the way. The numero uno is out of the harbor, ready to do some damage, and we put some cannons on him. Cannons... I tried to not use cannons with the numero uno in the very beginning. That was a mistake. Always use cannons. You're going to need them, not only for the ships of the dam, but they're going to become useful in any type of ship-to-ship -ship combat. Anyway, long-winded intro is over. I am Nick, guys. This is Nerd Parade. Welcome to the channel. Thank you so much for coming to hang with me today. And we're going to be doing some Uno Moss here in just a second. I'm going to go out looking for something to test this on. Now, I don't want to test it on Ships of the Dam because I've already tested this on Ships of the Dam and it's it, it's fine. It works fine. The cannons do what they need to do. Just stay ahead of the Ships of the Dam. It's fine. What I want to test this on is players. So I'm going to be sailing around here, seeing if I can find somebody or maybe roll up on somebody and get into some kind of PvP action because that's what the best part about being a pirate is. Is the PvP is on the high seas. Oh, okay, okay. All right, I'm getting fired at here. I got a little too close to somebody's business. They are very well equipped. Uh, well, I could start assaulting this place, but I don't know how well that would work out for me considering I'm one boat versus many. And I'm not equipped to take out... I'm not equipped to raid. This is more like a high seas combat vessel. Is this one kind of on its lonesome? I might take this one down. I want to see if I can take out crews on this. Oh, I got a red sails. Oh, shit, he spotted me. Oh, shit, he spotted me. Okay, get into the wind. Not taking anything out. We're going to try to bait. This is good, though. If I can get him away from home base, I can test out my ballista build. He's got to see the ballistas. He's got to think that this is a whaling vessel. And that probably works out. Seeing all the ballistas for sure convinces any normal person that this is a, a whaling vessel. And I've got handling sails on it, so it's not like this is a, a ship equipped for combat. But it's incognito. Secretly, it is. It's designed to be all combat. I don't want to see how well it holds up against this. Oh, all right, I'm going to cut it in. You know, oh, let me just like bring down my sails here a little bit. Put it against the wind. See if I can bring him up on me. Well, there's a shipwreck right there. All right, I'm just, I'm just turning. He's just going to think I'm turning. Oh, now he's going to go for a broadside. Let me bring it in. All right. You know, I'm, I'm going to try to juke. All right, everybody. Three, two, one. I'm going to open up the ports. Kill some of his peoples. You should only be hitting his peoples. 
Oh, I tricked him. I tricked him hard. I'm going to take some shots here, but I tricked him hard. All right, go, Ballistas, go. They're all set to only tamed creatures and survivors, so I'm hoping that it might actually wing one of the crew or one of the, the guy captaining it. No, and it didn't. With a full pass, it didn't. Not at all. All right, I got to... I got to... I gotta rethink these ballistas. I wanna save the ballista build. I'm working really hard to try to save the ballista build. I just don't know if it's in the cards. All right, chill, guys. We're gonna stop fire all groups. I'm gonna try to make another pass at him. Get away from the ship of the damned. I'll use him. I use him as bait. He's thinking. Oh shit, it did target me. He's going to say he's thinking the same thing. He's going to use that ship of the dam to his advantage. Not today, sir. Aha! It took the bait. Oh, it's already, it's tattering his sails. Yes, that's exactly what I wanted. Not specifically t sail tattering, but some kind of damage to it. Okay, great. I don't want the wind right now. I, will, I don't want the wind right now. I want him to catch up to me so I can keep turning him. And then I'm going to slice into the wind. This is what I want right here. This is what I want right here. Oh, I, I accidentally closed my gun ports. I want to keep them open. Kill his crew. Kill crew or kill captain. Come on, guns. Oh, shit. Okay, all right. Cutting into the wind. Ballista's not working as well as I wanted them to. That was my weaker side, too. My crew's not on that. Oh, there's two ships of the damned. All right, I got a, I got an idea. This is my ace in the hole. I'm going to see if I can go for the ace in the hole. If I can bait him to come up behind me, this is going to be glorious. This guy's probably like, oh, I've got to ram him right in the ass. Please, please take the bait. Please take the bait. Oh, no. My, what is this guy doing? He's turned off his sails. What could he possibly be thinking? Oh, don't you worry. Oh, sh okay. I'm going to take a couple of hits here. But that's fine. Oh, my God. That's hard. That's hard. Okay. Group nine. Go. Go, group nine. Go. Oh, I was too early. Group nine, fire again. Fire again. Yes. Bar shot. I wanted to take out those sails. Oh, it took out one of the... Sort of took out one of the white sails. I'm trying to take a bar shot shit right on him. That was sort of... Sort of a bait. It wasn't a perfect bait, but it worked out pretty well. Okay, group nine, chill. Everybody else, I want you to keep going again. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is bad. I'm back at your home port, buddy. I'm luring ships to the jam to your home port. He's still fighting it. My cunning strategies aren't as cunning as I think they are. Clearly. I thought those bar shots would have just slaughtered his sails. This is my weaker side, too. That ought to do something. Alright, numero uno. The ballistas, while a fantastic idea on paper... They don't seem to be targeting properly. I don't want them to hit any ship whatsoever. Okay, that guy's coming at me now. Switching targets. Oh good, we're both going over the damn now! That's fine. I got a missing plank. Damn! The ballista test was a failure! Alright, the ballistas are going. There's only going to be ballistas on here for wild... Elephant, or wild elephants, sea elephants, wild whales. But I can still take this guy down. I believe in myself. I believe in my captaineering skills. The cannons are going to be where it's at. 
Numero Uno was going to get a super facelift. The ballistas didn't work out for me the, the way I wanted to. I'm glad I got some testing in, though. This is very, very exciting. I got to get below deck, replace a plank. And I'll just ghost ride it for, the sec for a second. Oh, we've got... Oh, we need uh, Gunport here. But for now, it's just a regular plank. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did my crew just decide to mutiny on me? Get on there. That's why. That's... I thought you guys died. You're all terrible. You're all terrible, crew. <laughs> you are all terrible. You're all fired. Oh, shit. I don't have time to do this in the middle of combat. You guys are the worst crew in history. This is worse than mutiny. Ship of the damned. Yep, I'm sailing right into business. Oh, this guy's still on me. Let's get our sails back up and going. That one ship of the damned is kind of... The handling sails make it so much more maneuverable. And I can outmaneuver most ships. This is a guy... I mean, it... I'm debating getting rid of the weight sail. I'm sorry, the speed sail. For either a weight sail or another handling sail. Let me close my gun port so I'm even faster. Take out that boat. Oh yeah. I'm gonna freaking sail circles around this guy. Okay, we're opening up again. I got dick for wind, but that might be good. Because he's going to come at me, and I'm going to cut in. Men who decided to not man their stations, fire. Oof. Okay, group nine, go. Bar shot, bar shot, bar shot, go. Oh, I hit front, hit V. <laughs> he's done. He's no, he's got. He's not gonna fall for the same trick again, is he? That bar shot completely missed. Keep going, guys. Keep going. I'm stopped. He's gonna broadside me. That's taking some damage. Not a single crew of his was killed. I've got the wind, though. You're still after me. Well, now's when the ballistas are gonna just pinpoint freaking planks. Look, they're pinpointing planks now! But that's not enough! That's not enough power! I need more power for the ballistas to be worth it! That was kind of a great bait right there. I am the master debater. I don't want to get landlocked here. Oh, this guy's running. Oh, he's sinking. He has water on... Oh, I sunk it. I sunk it. I sunk his battleship. Oh, you know what? I'm going to drop anchor. Okay, chill, guys. Chill, 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 chill. We're going to drop anchor. Let's see if I can... His crew are coming at me. I'm going to chill my crew. Now the ballistas do, do their job. Now the ballistas are doing their job. This is what they were designed for all along, and now they decide that they actually want to try to do it. These guys now might be too close. I'm going for what's in that boat, though. Okay, good. My ladder's up. If they keep slaughtering crew, if I could piss off the crew, I'll pick up some of the ballista arrows on my way. Let's see what we got from our victory at sea. I don't see anybody currently boarding me. I did put up more swivel guns, so that won't happen again. <laughs> and I've got some ammunition and, gun and gunnery and weaponry on me right now. The 
Brig of War. I don't want to take too terribly much, because I don't want to get super fat, so let's look for the resource box if we can. Oh, hey, what's up? Oh, I heard a guy die. We have... Ooh, I'll take the alloy, because I'm going to need to repair my stuff. And 4k gold, hell yeah. The rest of this stuff I'm not too terribly worried about. It's just going to fatten me up. Ammo crate. If I can find ammo crate, we're in it. I'm going to win it. Excuse me, big giant rock. I'm looking for ammo. And I don't want to get manted. I don't see an ammo crate. Where the hell? Ow. I see a smithy. Screw you, manta. If you actually end up killing me. Okay, yeah, the manta's going to end up freaking killing me. I got to scram. Oh my god, the manta's gonna freaking kill me. Oh shit, the manta's gonna get me! <gasps> Run for the manta! No, it's too early! I'm too young! I'm too young to be Steve Irwin! We'll be alright! Whistle. Okay, ladder's down. Did he give up? Did he give up Chase? I think he did. 18 health. I didn't find the ammo chest, but I did find quite a bit of gold. And my crew's gonna be happy with that gold. Oh, so happy. And they're still trying to get on my boat. Ha ha ha! Captain Nerdbeard Pirates Another Day! Barely. I don't know how I survived that manta ray. That was the most dangerous creature of the sea! Okay, all right, back on. I see some... That son of a bitch is grappling up my sails. I just saw him spider-manning up my sails. He's gonna shoot at my crew. I don't know if I can do this. All right, yeah, he knows where I'm at. He knows I. He knows I know that he's here now. I think I got him locked down. My crew is just cluster effing him. I, I'm gonna back up. I don't want to get. I don't want to get cutlassed. <laughs> so this is the second time in a row. This is the sound. I, my swivel guns did nothing. Nothing. You're fired. They did nothing. Oh, hey. Give me some of that good stuff. They did absolutely nothing. I thought by having the swivel guns here that I was going to be protected. That I'd be able to do my pirate thing and not have to worry about it. But that guy managed to get onto my boat, grapple around from the sail to sail, and had I not been lucky enough to knock him down... He probably could have secretly, like, killed all of my crew had I not been on this boat. And the swivel cannon didn't react. So I must have messed something up with the swivel cannon or screwed up a targeting order or something. I will have to double check those guys. Let's let's check it out right now. Uh, that's Crazy Joe. Let's check to the swivel cannon. Only survivors. Change from rage. And you're on station group. They're not on a station group. This has to be why. Let's put you on six. Are you on a station group? Be careful with your station groups. I, that's gotta be why. I had said everything else. I think I just messed up the station groups. I thought that I was safe. I thought that I was safe at seas, but I was wrong. We got some really good testing in on this episode, though. I'm excited for it. We sunk that poor brig by just accident. Accidental pirating, which I think is the best form of pirating. We accidentally sunk that brig. Found out that the blistas are not worth our effort. I'm going to stick some mostly at the rear, maybe some at the front to counter whales. But other than that, we're going back to our cannon builds with our galleon. I'm going to get the hell out of here for now. But I want to thank you guys so much for sticking with me on Uno Mas. I hope you enjoyed this episode. It was some ridiculous pirate shenanigans like there's never been. 
But without my crew, I think I would have lost that encounter. So good job, crew. I'm glad half of you decided to uh, abort your mission of firing the cannons halfway through. I'm some stuck on some serious land. This is the worst cove ever. But I gotta get out of here before somebody else decides to come out and greet me. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Please remember to take care of yourselves out there. Stay awesome. Drop a thumbs up on the video if you liked it. Subscribe to the channel if you deem so worthy. But else, otherwise, stay awesome, and we'll catch you in the next one. Later.